Cigarette butts are really damaging to the environment because when they enter the waterways, they damage wildlife habitats as they pass through. So we used humour to try something different. Ms No Butts is part of the Little Hotspots program and the main goal for this program or campaign was to minimise cigarette butt litter throughout the city of Greater Dandenong and create a campaign that any council could pick up. We weren't able to get it to reach far enough without creating a video so we thought we'd run with that idea and applied for funding through the Litter Hotspots program and that enabled us to be able to create the anti-butt litter videos and stretch them throughout the community and hopefully further than that as well. Do you know throwing your butt can do to the environment? Huh? Birds can choke and Die. <laughs> Is that what you want? We saw a 82% decrease in the amount of cigarette butt litter at our three hotspots. Our project is called Operation Infrastructure and the goal of the project is to reduce cigarette butt litter from going into our waterways. So we partnered with universities and hospitals. We audited the sites to understand where the litter was a problem. Then we looked at those audits and targeted those sites to install 60 cigarette butt bins. People have a tendency to be lazy and so it's important to locate cigarette butt bins in areas where people can see them. They're obvious, they're visible, they're convenient. Um, they're not too far away from where people are going to be actually smoking. But I think the really innovative part of our project has been what happens to that waste once it's put in the bins. We had the opportunity to partner with TerraCycle, who are a global recycling company. So we were able to change the message and say, recycle your butts here, rather than don't drop them on the ground. I was always very passionate about the creek. I'd sort of pick up rubbish on my own, but then one day a, a mutual contact of ours decided to put us all together as a group and we all jumped at the chance and we came together and started doing it religiously and now we can't stop. We decided to use art because we're interested in art. We find that it's a really good way to communicate an idea subtly so you can get a message across while being decorative and fun at the same time. Jody started off running litter cleanups along the creek. We do bigger cleanups in the centre of Sunshine itself, they're called Take It to the Streets. We do information sessions with schools, we've got our mural, our bin wraps, decals, we've got Barry the Butt who goes around to festivals and things and gives out free personal ashtrays. We've got just a plethora of things that we do. It's just continuing that love where you live message to try and encourage people to pick up rubbish, not to drop rubbish and to take care of their local environment.